Hi, thanks for coming back to the chopping block. So we know that velocity is the primary factor in determining whether a bullet gets through soft armor. We also know, generally speaking, that the more layers of Kevlar you have, the better chance you have of stopping a projectile. So what if a rifle bullet was moving about as slowly as you could reasonably still say that it was a rifle bullet and you had a lot of Kevlar? Okay, so what I did is I took all of the soft armor panels that I had sitting around and that I was willing to shoot, and I stacked them all together. We have a level 3A CATI soft panel, a level 2A Gauls soft panel, and two IBA groin protectors. They're roughly equivalent to 3A, give or take. A little bit more flexible than most 3A. What do you think? We're gonna shoot 300 blackout, 147 grain full metal jacket from cellular and below at this stack of soft armor and see what happens. One, eight, seven, two. I'd say that is pretty conclusive. <laughs> You're done, you're done, you're done, you're done, you're done. It's just still trucking. There's a little, little fragment in this one. I'm not sure, but I think this is actually a piece of a bullet from another test that got shoved into that jug because this is thicker than a normal copper jacket that actually looks like one of the pieces from the controlled chaos I did <laughs> okay so I'm surprised but not surprised I mean that's a lot of armor and I kind of sort of thought that it had a chance of stopping it because the bullet wasn't moving that fast. That said, soft armor doesn't do well against rifle rounds and that rifle round did not care. It went through all of that armor and slammed through a ton of water. That was absolutely conclusive. If you were behind that, I don't care. You're going to have a bad day. If somebody's shooting at you with a real rifle, 7.62 by 51 or 5.56 or whatever, at any reasonable range, you are, you're probably not going to do well. You know, hey, uh, maybe if I had more soft armor to stack behind it, eventually it would stop. But, you know, if I had 25 yards worth of styrofoam peanuts, that might stop it too. The point here is that no reasonable amount of soft armor is going to stop a rifle round. As always, thanks for watching. Uh, please comment, subscribe, share. All of those things make a big difference for small channels like mine. If you're already subscribed and you want to make sure that you don't ever miss a video, make sure you click the little bell icon that's right next to the subscribe button and check the box that says that you want to be notified every time a video comes out. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day.
All right, so what I did is I took 